For the first time ever, students from outside the country are paying in-state college tuition. Southwestern College just rolled out this new program. ABC 10 News reporter Perla Shaheen spoke with one student who says it will change the trajectory of her life. An unprecedented state law going into effect right. this semester gave Melanie Garcia what she describes as the opportunity of a lifetime. It would have been impossible for me to study here. Garcia was born in Tijuana, but she's paying in-state tuition to attend Southwestern College. A new California law allows in-state opportunities for low-income students who are attending local community colleges and live 45 miles from the border with Mexico. An American degree will open more opportunities in the future worldwide, not only in America or in Mexico, but in other parts of the world. Director of Binational and International Programs, Joel Pilko, says a full-time international student pays at least eight times more for tuition than in-state. He believes this program opens the door for many who would have never considered coming to the U.S. for their education. We are really intentional about creating opportunities for the economy in the region, right? We know for a fact that we're going to need more nurses, medical doctors, engineers. Southwestern is one of the first schools to roll out this program. Pilko says 51 students are participating so far. He hopes to enroll the maximum, 150 students, into the program next semester. There are thousands of U.S. citizens attending high school in Tijuana looking for an opportunity to come back to the U.S. to do college studies here. Garcia says she feels overwhelmed by the support she's received so far. She's already found her community at Southwestern and is looking forward to exploring classes around architecture and graphic design. Perla Shaheen, ABC 10 News. Perla covers community colleges, East County and Middle Eastern communities. If there is a story you want her to know about, scan the QR code on your screen or email her at perla.shaheen at 10news.com.